आटे का हलवा इज मेड विद होल वीट फ्ला जैगरी इन घी एंड आई एश्योर यू दैट ऑल द कैलोरीज इन दिस हलवा आर गोइंग टू बी कम्प्लीटली वर्थ इट सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड विद इट I'm going to start off by putting in 3/4 cup 220 grams of jaggery into this pan over here. One and a half cups 375 ml water. I'm going to heat this until the jaggery dissolves completely into the water. I'm going to keep this on low heat as I don't want this to boil. I'm going to put in 100 grams about half a cup of ghee into this pan. Use the best possible ghee you can lay your hands on. And once the ghee melts and you get this beautiful golden hued color characteristic of ghee, I'm going to put in some flour. So in goes about 105 grams about 3/4 of a cup of whole wheat flour Now this needs to cook on low heat until the flour acquires a deep brown color It's important to keep stirring this all the while or else the flour would stick to the bottom of the pan and get burnt I've been stirring this for about 8 to 10 minutes and the raw smell of the flour has completely disappeared Make sure that your heat is turned down and then carefully pour in the jaggery water You need to whisk this up well to make sure that there are no lumps. This needs to cook just for a minute more and then the halwa is done. To finish the dish, I'm going to put in some cardamom powder made from the seeds of four cardamom pods. Stir it up well. And it's now ready to serve. I'm going to garnish the halwa with some slivered almonds but you could use any other nuts of your choice as well. You can make this for a festive occasion or you could even make it for yourself when you have a sweet craving or you could even dish it up when you have unexpected guests as this comes together quite quickly. I hope you like this recipe. Do give it a try and let me know how you liked it.